On Saturday, November 9th, John Moxley versus Kenny Omega. Kenny Omega the myth seems to think I'm some kind of joke. Are you ready to sacrifice it all? Cody versus Chris Jericho. The man continues to reinvent himself. There is nothing that Chris Jericho has that scares me. For the AEW World Championship. And the champion is going to celebrate with a little bit of the bubbly. All Elite Wrestling presents Full Gear. Live tonight at 8 p.m. Eastern. Only on pay-per-view. What's going on, everyone? Golden Boy here, and we are live in Baltimore, Maryland at the Royal Farms Arena for full gear. That's right, folks. It's going to be a wild night with the best of the best in all elite wrestling competing for your entertainment. Now, we are going to have some great exclusives here, and we're going to talk to your favorite wrestlers, so let's just jump right into it. Hey, I see you. Mind if I get a quick interview before we get started? Problem. First of all, you guys look amazing. It's that game day trip. You like oh, that? Oh, nice. How are you guys feeling going into your first title defense today? You know, Jen, this time we're not coming into Royal Farms Arena as the underdogs. This time we are rolling into full gear as champions. Oh, nice. Jen Decker, SCU is in Baltimore. Baltimore happens to be the worst town we've ever been in. But, but, and this is a big but. Scorpio Sky loves big butts, but <laughs> Baltimore is full of badass wrestling fans and each and every one of them are going to watch SCU walk into that ring, tag team champions, and walk out of that ring, tag team champions, despite the fact that we're defending our titles against not one, but two of the best teams in the world, Lucha Brothers, Private Party. It doesn't matter who's in there, Pentagon, Phoenix, Mark Quinn, Isaiah Cassidy, David Cassidy, Butch Cassidy, Leaf Cassidy, what you gentlemen need to understand is that while it may not rain often in SoCal, our SoCal rain is forever. Best of luck today, gentlemen. Best see you there. Unprofessional. Reckless. You want to talk, Brit? Or do you want to shoot? See, first it was your concussion. Then your black eye. Boo hoo, Britt Baker. We are in a full contact sport and it is not my fault that you are not trained well enough to know how to protect yourself properly. And do you want to go around saying that I'm unprofessional? You are a f***ing dentist. You spend all your week playing with people's teeth. I spend my week training in the Japanese dojo, learning from some of the best women's wrestlers in the world. This is my profession. Wrestling for you, Brit. It's just something you do on your days off. I am reckless, but I get the job done. You, all you do is complain and whine on Twitter, making little excuses. I don't need to make excuses. My work proves itself. But hey, I'll say it now. You've got the perfect hair, great body Brit, fantastic poster girl for any promotion. You're perfect for wrestling. Five years ago. And I think all these excuses are just leading back to the facts that you cannot hang with B Priestley. You are too scared to admit that you do not belong in this new era. Britt, I'm the most dangerous person you're ever gonna step in the ring with. I think you've highly underestimated what I can do. Yep, yeah, you've seen everything I can do so far, but that is nothing compared to what's coming to front of you on Saturday. A full gear. I will end Britt Baker. Here with Hangman Adam Page. Page, the first AEW rankings are out. You are listed as number three in the singles division. Mm. Pack is number two. Is your expectation, if you beat him here tonight at full gear, that you're going to be getting an AEW world title shot? I'm here tonight to do one thing. I'm worried about one thing tonight, and that is giving Pac the ass-whooping that he is long overdue for. 
I'm here to blister his chest, to break his back, to snap his neck, to stomp his little balls until they pop. Whatever happens after that, nah, that happens. But tonight, I'm here to do cowboy This is Alex Marvez for AEW. I understand what you're saying. You're the purveyor of violence? You're saying it doesn't count. Yeah. Technically, it won't count against your win-loss record. It's going to be a great match, but we can't be responsible for what happens. We have to make it a lights-out match. You're kidding me, man. I'm Win sorry. over Kenny Omega. I've been working for this. I've been working for this for months, ever since I showed up here. I had the balls to go after the top guy, your boy. And now you say it doesn't count. I'm unsanctionable. What happens to Kenny Omega is now on your hands, all right? His ass is on the line because of you. I only know one speed. I put my foot on the gas pedal and I press it to the floor. For a while, that got taken away from me. And I'm never going to let it get taken away again. You know, you got this guy who's got all this hype behind him. Oh, he jumped ship. He came from the largest promotion in the world. Everybody was talking about John Moxley. The world was talking about John Moxley. The legend of Kenny Omega, the greatest wrestler that ever lived. The Rembrandt, the Van Gogh of professional wrestling. I know that you want to make a statement probably more than anyone. And that fuels me. Everyone wants to be the best, right? Right? Okay, everyone wants to be the best, they want to be called the best, they want to be the hot topic of the moment by taking it out on me. Hmm? That where you came from, what you stand for, who you are, is better than the person that people call the best in the world. Kenny Omega the myth seems to think I'm some kind of joke. And I assure you, it's not going to be the least bit funny when I break jaw. You are gonna see beautiful, glorious wrestling violence, like which we haven't seen in this country in decades. I'm gonna beat Kenny Omega within an inch of his life. Do you know how many people from where you come from wished that they could try to prove themselves with me that I'm better than what you guys had over there? Undeniable fact is, I am the baddest son of a bitch in this game. These two titans squaring off. Unsanctioned, they want unsanctioned. I'm unsanctionable. Hey, Joey. You've had a rough go with it, you know, these past couple weeks. How are you feeling going into your match with Sean Spears tonight? Shannon. Had a rough couple weeks. The sugar daddy, Tully Blanchard, and the sugar baby, Sean Spears, are probably at a mall right now. They're not taking this match too seriously. Sugar daddy Tully buying sugar baby Spears a new Chanel purse. Well, I'm here for business. For the first time in a long time, I'm feeling a certain type of way. And the thing is, you like to call yourself the chairman, Sean Spears. But I know a lot more than you do about that piece of steel. But the thing is, I don't need that tonight. I don't need ladders. I don't need thumbtacks. I don't need barbed wire. Look at me, Sean Spears. And you too, old man, Tully Blanchard. All I need is my fists. Joey Janela has been pigeonholed 
into this hardcore outlaw mud show goofball nonsense. But the thing is, a lot of the new fans, a lot of the new All Elite fans that are just learning about Joey Janela right now, don't know what I'm capable of. <laughs> and Tully Blanchard, Sean Spears, tonight at Full Gear, Baltimore, Maryland, everyone's gonna find out that Joey Janela is a bad, bad boy. Any more questions? Tonight, man. Be safe, all right? Give me a reason, a reason to live. There's not any part of me that's going to be in the ring that's an EVP. Every part of me is a kid with a chip on his shoulder who probably wanted to beat this guy 10 years ago and thought he could. Give me a reason. Chris Jericho, and I am the champion of AEW. As soon as Cody told me that he was going to challenge Jericho for the title, I knew we were just going to lose him for this period of time. No matter who thinks they're in charge around here, we're in charge now. Chris Jericho is professional wrestling. You hear the chance of Cody has this connection with the fans that is very rarely seen in pro wrestling. He is the face of this company. However, he's not the champion. Winning that championship belt, it would be the pinnacle of his career. for the AEW World Championship bout between the champion, Chris Jericho, and the challenger, the American Nightmare, Cody. This thing on? <laughs> What's up, Cody? Hager's... Oh, no! It's about the 14 years it took me to go from undesirable to un-goddamn-deniable! Jericho and Cody, what a war this is going to be. If I do not defeat Chris Jericho at full gear, I will never challenge for the AEW World Championship again. Chris Jericho, that is a very big if. At full gear, I beat you. have it folks everyone is ready to go for full gear now I'm gonna get ready for the buy-in and you should too and we'll see you then pressure I don't feel pressure pressure is something somebody else tries to put on you the only pressure that's worth anything is the pressure you put on yourself pressure sets people apart are you prepared to do whatever it takes to accomplish your goal those that have the ability to thrive under pressure can achieve greatness Success is anything that you strive for. You put in the grind, then you grind more. Accomplish your goals, then you find more. And you don't need to rest if you want to be the best. If you want it, don't wait your turn. None of this is given. Everything is earned. If you want it, don't wait your turn. None of this is given. Everything is earned. This is when we shine the brightest, is when the pressure's on and we have to remind the people again that we've been doing it for so long that yes, we're still the best. The DNA of a true champion 
allows them to actually perform better when pressure is at its greatest. Full Gear will be a night surrounded by pressure. We have to earn everything we got. We earn being here. We earn being in AEW. Greatness demands everything. Cody, what a war this is going to be. If I do not defeat Chris Jericho at full gear, I will never challenge for the AEW World Championship again. None of this is given, everything is earned. If you want it, don't wait your turn. None of this is given, everything is earned. Will Kenny Omega be able to seek his revenge on John Moxley? Are the Young Bucks still considered the best tag team in the world today? Will Cody be able to slay the current AEW World Champion, Chris Jericho? All Elite Wrestling presents Full Gear, live tonight at 8 p.m. Eastern, only on Pay-Per-View.